Uh, so I wanted to make a video to kind of show you my workflow and to show you guys a few tips and tricks and how I manage to make money. So right now I am making nine dollars and 13 cents an hour, which is um, it's not the cap or anything. And it's not the best you can do, but it is a lot better than minimum wage. Um, I've only been at it about a half an hour and I've made five dollars. Um, if I were to add all this up, it's about five dollars without any kind of bonuses I would get. Um, so the way that I work it is. Uh, that I usually have about four tabs running. So you need to make sure that when you are doing, I'm going to put this here. So when you are doing MTurk, you need to make sure that you only have one tab open to dashboard. So when you very first log on, you need to go to mturk.com and it's going to look something like this. And you need to just click on dashboard and only have it running on one tab. I put my dashboard tab to the far left because it just kind of keeps it like kind of organized. Um, and the reason for that is the scripts that you're running only work off the dashboard. So uh, they, the code, when you download it in the source code, it works off of the dashboard app. So if you were to have two running, none of the scripts that you're using will work. So I have um, I have four scripts downloaded, but I only really use three. I use Turkmaster. Uh, I switched it out for this one, which I don't remember what it's called. Um, kind of like Turk, I think it's just projected earnings. And then I use, um, I usually use MTurk Suite, which is on a different website. And I'll make a video about that. So the way that I do it is I have this running on the hits that I really like and I have it going so when I'm working on a batch or something I can just kind of see it so this is popping up here and it's going to show up when I'm working on a different hit it's going to show me all kinds of ones that I can do so right now I'm going to go over here um so if we're working on a batch I'm going to accept this batch so there are two ways that you can do it you can uh accept a bunch at one time and work off your hits queue or you can just work off of this with auto accept. So with ones like this, they, they don't really go really quick because they're not rated super great. But I personally like them because I can do them really, really fast. So I don't try to snag them. But uh, I'm going to undo this one. So I'm going to do... I'm going to do this really quick to kind of show you guys and keep in mind um, I've done this hit on most of the videos because they're really good paying hits. I really like the requester and I can make money pretty quick off them, but I'm going to go through it really quick. Uh, and they usually don't take this long again, but I'm kind of recording. So I'm going to do them really quick so you guys can kind of see how long it takes to make 12 cents. So how would you ask an automatic chatbot about the WPCU presidency? Okay. But you and see this little thing right here it's a little bit irritating noise but it's gonna um it's gonna be giving you hits that you can do so you'll eventually make more money so while i was doing that hit i just got another hit for 50 cents so could you tell me more about the wpcu hierarchy oh my breaker that's the one um i'm gonna hit pause and finish this really quick so this can get a little bored Okay, so I finished that hit. It was 12 cents. So if I were to continue doing that batch, I would have just hit the little button up here for, oh, I don't know where it went, um, to auto it to um, automatically accept. So uh, while I was doing that, I actually snagged a couple hits. So I'm going to go over here. So when you're doing something and you, those little things pop up down here. Uh, and you hit accept, they're going to go to something called your hits queue. So I recommend that you work off of your hits queue 90% of the time because it's going to show you what you need to do. It's going to tell you how much time you have left and it's going to give you it in a way that it's going to be really uniform and easy to follow. So uh, I should only have one or two in my hits queue right now. So I have two. So the way this works is I would hit work on this hit and um, I can't really show you the surveys because I think they're legal. But I would do this survey and um, then when I would finish that survey, I would hit submit and it would automatically take me to the next hit that I have in my queue. So one thing that I want to point out when you're doing this is I cannot express this enough. You need to right click to open the survey in a new tab, because if you don't, sometimes it messes it up and it puts the survey on the MTurk server. And it's really, really difficult to put the code in. So when you do a survey, there are a couple things that I recommend to do. Um, and I'm going to post a survey that I posted that I'm going to be able to video. But you need to make use of your tab your tab keys and your arrow keys. So um, there's going to be these little questions and it's going to say like how much you disagree, strongly disagree, don't disagree at all, mildly disagree. And instead of clicking with your uh, with your little clicker mouse, you just use the tabs and it knocks off about half the amount of time that it takes to do the survey because you can just read the question really quick and tab, 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 tab. And I'll make a video kind of showing you how quick that works. So I've already done this hit, but do you see how it kind of why uh, Turk Master is so good? Because it shows hits that I can do that I've already kind of signed up for down here while I'm working on something else. So I'm going to exit out of this. Um, 
So another thing that I like to do, uh, and if you ever need to get back to the main page, you just hit this Amazon Mechanical Turk, and it won't take you to Dashboard. You can only get to Dashboard if you come here and then click on Dashboard. And again, I only have one Dashboard working. So another thing I like to do uh, while that's working for me is I like to manually look for um, higher paying surveys. So I do highest surveys. Um, we'll start out, I don't know, I just like to do it like that. So we'll start out here. And these higher paying hits aren't always surveys. Um, so this one is seven dollars and fifty cents. I did this a few days ago the same hit it took me about 20 minutes, maybe so that was really really good so um, Friday Saturday Sunday and like the summer aren't the best for getting hit So if you see I'm doing this and there's all these ones coming up So they're not like the best for getting hits. So today's not gonna be great, but you know Kind of hit or miss on the weekend so i'm gonna go through here and kind of look at different surveys um there's none that i want to do right now uh family study so say i'm on this page and if you remember this is the ones that i filtered out for hits that i'm qualified for and reward amount highest first so the way that that works is it's going to filter not going to filter out but it's going to uh it's going to place it in a way like if you've ever searched on Amazon and you go from like price lowest to highest, price ho highest to lowest, that's what it's going to do. It's going to show you the ones that pay the most first. So this is already the page I'm on. So say I want to do this one, which I don't because she is really awful. I would just right click this and um, I could open it and accept it and not lose my place on this page. So let's see if we can get one that I actually want to do. Uh, I think I've already done this one, but I'll give it a shot. So I would just right click, open link in new tab. And the reason I'm kind of showing you all this, I've already done this hit, is because uh, I think a lot of people get confused and they don't really make enough use of the scripts that they're running. And I kind of wanted to show you my workflow and keep in mind that I've been um, making video recordings while I'm doing this, but I'm still making $9.13 an hour, which to me is really great. I could just be because I live in the South and minimum wage is $7.25. Um, okay, let's see if we can get any. So I'm not a German speaker. Give us your opinion on a negotiation. So I'm just going to quick look over here, 429. Uh, if it's a batch and you're going to be doing a whole lot of the same hits, I really don't recommend anything under like 450. Uh, you can take a chance if you have a high rating, but if it's something that's like a survey, uh, mostly the only reason people get screened out of surveys is because they don't look for the test question. So I want to do this hit. I'm going to open it in a new tab. Um, I don't need to work off of this. I'm just going to exit out of it. So that's going to show up in my hits queue, which we're going to go to in a second. So I'm going to keep going and try to find some more while Turk Master is refreshing. <clears throat> so I'm going to actually be looking over here too. Hits unqualified for most first. Um, so I don't really do a lot of one, one cent hits because mostly they're not really worth your time. But there are some hits that go so quickly, like it literally takes one second and they're done and it's a penny a second, which doesn't sound like a lot, but it actually adds up. So I always just kind of keep a lookout for those too. So I've already done this hit on my cell phone on the other video I made. And okay, so here's another thing. Um, if your Turk Opticon's not showing up, all you have to do is go up here and refresh your browser. Oh man, come on girl. Call my computer girl. So here we go. It's working now. So I'm going to look here and now I'm looking for batches. So I already have this over here. Now that I'm looking for batches, I have this looking for surveys for me. So I'm actually going to refresh this because it's not dinging enough. And then I'm going to hit these surveys and they're going to be working for me while I'm looking for batches. So I don't want to do any of those right now. So right now I'm looking for batches, 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 one cent, cancel. So image riddle solvent. I have no idea what this is, uh, but it's rated good. So we're going to get it and we're going to give it a shot. So I'm going to open the link in new tab. Okay, this seems like a lot of work for one cent. So I'm going to return this girl. But that's kind of that's pretty much how, how it works. So um, if you're looking for surveys, you can have this working for you. Uh, if you're looking for batches, you can look for yourself. You can have another thing that I do, too, is I look for batches. Um, so I have those batches. So I'm going to do batches that pay at least five cents and I'm going to hit apply. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to watch this page. So now it's going to alert me. Whenever, whenever, uh, 
whenever a new batch comes up. So that can give me time to look under a different criteria. So I'm going to tell you guys kind of like write it down too so you can remember better on the kind of ways that you should be looking for hits. So another thing that I do too, and I don't really know a whole lot of people that do this, but I do know people that I do know and they really recommend it, is you look for the creation date newest hits first. Um, and I do one, one cent. So yeah. So again, this is really cool. So I'm just going to accept that, that in the hit. Um, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Go away now. Yeah. Sometimes that can get a little bit irritating. So now I'm going to hit apply and I'm going to look for newest created hits. So this is going to be kind of hit or miss because if you refresh the page, it's going to change you, but it's going to give you hits that are newer. So you may be able to snag them a little quicker than other people. Oh, except there's 75 cents. No more of those hits available. Image riddle solving. So we're doing this. Okay, so I'm not seeing anything, so I'm going to hurry up and go to my hits queue and kind of show you how to work off there. So you see me, I got like, what, like three or four hits? So I would just work off of my hits queue. And then while I'm working on those, it's going to be getting me. See, it's just hits, 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 hits. So that's kind of the main point of uh, why we run scripts and why people run scripts, why people create scripts. And so, so you see why I've been talking, I haven't been doing anything. My hourlies dropped down to 788. Uh, but if you're continually working on it, you can easily make nine to $10 an hour. But the reason we run scripts is to make it a lot more efficient and to make it so where whenever you're doing something, you can be making money. Also, you can be picking up hits. You can be picking up all kinds of stuff. So I just really, um, wanted to show you guys kind of my workflow to show that you can make $9 an hour really easy. Uh, I think $9 an hour is super, super duper doable. Uh, another thing you can do is just look for a survey. If you really like taking surveys, uh, and just want to pay at least five cents and you can look for that. And then I don't like to do transcription tasks, but if you like to do transcription tasks, you can just look up transcriptions. Um, I actually got kicked out of a lot of them because I don't really pay good enough attention to them. So they kind of banned me. Um, and then one more thing that you should be doing too is every once in a while you need to be going through and doing this right here. So you need to take off hits on qualified for, uh, make this be zero. And you want to go through and try to get qualifications. So they're going to be the ones in yellow. So crowdsource is one that you do for uh, transcription. So it's red because a lot of people aren't very good at it, including me. But some people are really good at it. So if you wanted to do this, which you're not going to let me, but you would just hit qualify. So I've already like ruined that. So I can't do it anymore. So if you go through, you see where you're like, oh, man, this looks really cool. You just hit qualify. That's it. Um, and that'll open you up to a lot more tasks. Uh, you can also look for um, qualifications. So you need to do this probably when you first start. I can't feel. Maybe if I feel the right one, please fill. G -G -L. Okay, right, I'm done here. Okay, so I'm gonna work here on my thing, and there's gonna be on my hits queue, and there's gonna be things popping up. Uh, I should be popping up back to about fifteen dollars an hour when I get working on it, and I'm not making videos or eating lunch because I'm fixing a tear into this uh, bourbon sandwich here. So if you have any questions, um, if you need any more in-depth answers to any kind of videos or you need me to explain anything any better, just hit me up and tell me. Um, I'll be posting some more videos with some more, a little bit more difficult uh, tips and tricks. This is just like the basics of it. So thank you guys. And if it's helpful, just, I don't know.